In observance of National Police Week, which started on May 12th and ends on May 18th, one of the local traditions is a flag ceremony to honor and remember fallen law enforcement officers who were killed in the line of duty. This morning, in front of the Public Safety Building, which is home to the Harrisonburg Police Department, the annual flag ceremony started with a welcome from Harrisonburg Police Chief Eric English, followed by the flag ceremony by the Harrisonburg Rockingham Honor Guard, which includes members of the Harrisonburg Police Department and the Rockingham County Sheriff's Office. Following the raising of the flags, remarks were given by Chief English. I want to take this time to acknowledge the service and the ultimate sacrifice of those in law enforcement. While they should never or well, they should forever be honored. This ceremony is but a small acknowledgement of the appreciation we have for our fellow officers. This profession is extremely noble, and we realize and understand the rigors of the job. Yet we humbly accept the responsibility and try to provide the best service to our citizens. Unfortunately, there are times when our service results in the loss of life due to the dangers and responsibilities of this job. The speaker for the ceremony was Rockingham County Commonwealth's attorney, Marsha Garst. While you are a thin blue line, behind you are scores of this that stand with you. You are not alone. We are grateful for you because we can sleep soundly in our beds and our children can play in the yard and on our streets in this beautiful city and county because of you. You are from every creed, every color, every gender, every background, and that is what makes you great. Your strength is in your diversity. It makes you stronger, your wealth of experience, your wealth of training. As a citizen of this community for all of my life, it has been no prouder moment than to stand with these men and these women who sacrifice so much to stand every day for you. They are underpaid, underappreciated, and criticized. But yet they stand. The local fallen officers honored and remembered today are Sergeant Manuel Trenary of the Harrisonburg Police Department, who was killed on October 8th of 1959. Patrolman Wayne Stoudemire of the Bridgewater Police Department, who was killed on May 25th of 1976. Deputy John Rafter of the Rockingham County Sheriff's Office, who was killed on February 7th of 1983. And Chief Wilm Davies of the Grottles Police Department, who was killed on July 21st, of 1988. While the area has not lost an officer in the line of duty since July of 1988, Chief English said nationally over 160 officers were killed in the line of duty last year. According to the Officer Down Memorial page, there were 163 officers that lost their lives in 2018 in the line of duty. That's 163 individuals from different parts of the United States, different backgrounds, that did not expect that they would not return home. These are the heroes, the peacekeepers in this profession, and we honor them here today. Immediately after the ceremony, the Salvation Army Corps hosted a Coffee with a Cop event on the premises. Locally, National Police Week events continue this evening at Klein's Dairy Bar on South Main Street from 3 to 5 p.m. at an event titled Cone with a Cop. Another Cone with a Cop event will be held on Thursday from 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. at the same location. Locally, National Police Week will conclude with a private annual police valor and awards banquet on Saturday, May 18th. In downtown Harrisonburg, Theodore Whitelow, Breaking Through News.